Only a cut woman is a good woman. Sorry, what cut? <laughs> okay, now you're gonna have to teach me English. This is how she stays a virgin, yes? Until her wedding night, and then her man opens her. That's the way, isn't it? Where's the don't know what you're talking about? You're not cut? Yes, I mean, so Desert Flower um, is the story of uh, this young nomadic girl from Somalia. And uh, she, it's basically her, her journey into, um, it's her journey, it's her life story. It's her going from no, nomadic lifestyle to going to London and to becoming a maid and then from then on to become a, uh, this incredible fashion model and then from there to, uh, for the first time, being the first person to ever talk about female genital mutilation. Can you tell this young lady she was stitched up far too tightly, a, a real botch up, I have to say. And can you say, I'd like to operate as soon as possible? Why not? Why not? Well, tell her she's doing the right thing. I mean, it's amazing she's put up with this for so long. She must be in absolute constant torment, but she mustn't worry. We can fix it. Sure. Um. I got the book and, and, and read the story of Warris, and that's really how I first discovered, actually, uh, sort of the phenomenon that Warris is and, and her story. And, and I was so... It's such an incredible book. It's such a wonderful story. Uh, and I was inspired, and I was moved, and I, I absolutely wanted to be a part of that project. So, Warris, do you think about harm a lot? For, for me, this is the story relates to all of us. I think it's a story about being a girl. You know, it's a story about being a young girl and then being a, about, about being a woman and, you know, what we face every day. And, and there's a lot of things that we have to face and have to deal with. And it's not easy, you know. And, and it's, and you, I mean, yes, definitely you relate to the struggles that she goes through and, and, uh, discovering yourself, you know, finding who you are and and starting from zero again, you know, and, and getting outside of your, I mean, for a lot of people, you know, who get out of their comfort, comfort zone to try something new and get burnt every time you go out, but then you keep going again and then you find something beautiful after. Um, I think it's a